<laughs> hey guys. Hi Mimi. Welcome to my space for the day. Thank you. You're very punctual. So Mimi, <laughs> would you consider yourself a foodie? Absolutely. What's your favorite dessert? Ice cream. Favorite fashion trend of all time? Probably wide leg pants. If you had a tattoo, where would it be? It'll be here. What's the priciest thing you've ever splurged on? Hmm. Maybe a pair of shoes. Who is your fashion icon? I can never pick one person, but I would say Kalana Barfield, uh, Solange, and the new Lady Gaga. Most stylish person you ever know? Most stylish person I know. Maybe my friend Ini. What's your favorite movie of all time? Remember the Titans. If you could choose to be a character from a movie, who would you be and what movie? That's a hard question, but I think I'll settle on Beyonce's character Dina from Dreamgirls without all the drama. Last movie you cried to? <laughs> I'm shy. I'm so shy to say this was. It's not a movie, it was an episode of Modern Family. I don't know why that show makes me cry. If your entire life was a movie, what title would best suit it? Huh. Sparkle. Who would you want to shoot a love scene with? Bradley Cooper. If you could host any show in the world, what would it be? X Factor, and this is me putting it into the universe. If you were a hip hop artist, what would your stage name be? <laughs> Sparkle and Flow. <laughs> you guys know I got the next game right. <laughs> What's the hardest part about hosting a show? Huh, probably try not to forget my lines. What's the easiest part? Dressing up. What's the longest song you've ever listened to on your phone? The longest song I've ever listened to on my phone? Um, Justin's song, Mirrors, was it called Mirrors? Oh, Mirror, yeah, that song is like nine minutes long. What's the most nervous you've ever felt? Hmm, maybe the very first time I picked up a microphone to do my job. What's your favorite holiday season and why? It has to be summer. I mean, what else? It's the sun, it's short shorts, um, it's music, it's fun, it's beaches, and it's just a great vibe all around. What's your favorite country to visit? I would say Greece. I've only been there once, but something tells me I'm going to go there so many more times in my lifetime. Hey, hey, hey Balaji. Who do you text the most? My friend Shola. Last country you visited? Cuba. So Mimi, if you're stuck on an island, you can only pick one food to eat forever. What are you getting to eat? Huh, this is very bad for me, but I'll say rice. I mean, you can make rice in like a hundred different ways. Hmm. If you could switch lives with someone for a day, who would it be? Beyonce. Would you rather <laughs> have a photographic memory or gain an extra 40 IQ points? I think I'll do with the extra 40 IQ points. Favorite place to hang out in Lagos? Zen bar. Heels or flats? I should say flats, but pills. Kittens or puppies? Definitely potty. puppies. I hate kittens. I hate cats. Who's the last person you texted? My mom. I've got a meeting downstairs. Do you guys mind? One thing you can't live without? This boat. In three <laughs> words, how would you describe your friendship with Ini Dima Okoje? Oh, fun, cute, and very supportive. If you had to choose to live without one of your five senses, what would you give up? Huh, what can I do without? I mean none, but if you insist on an answer, I'd say my sense of touch. What's the name of your first boyfriend? Mm, his name was Dende. What's the name of your current boyfriend? I'm very single right now. What advice would you give yourself at 13? Huh, I think I would tell her to... I'd tell her to be a lot more bold and to not be afraid to say no. Larry Da Silva or Fablin by Daring? I could never choose. Netflix and chill with the boo or a night with the girls? I mean, there's no boo right now, so a night with the girls, definitely. So what are you doing right after this interview? I've got a meeting downstairs. All right, Mimi, thank you so much. Thank you for coming. Enjoy the rest of your day.